As an entrepreneur, you need to be self-motivated or you will never get anything done because there's no boss hovering over your shoulder and giving you deadlines to meet. Lots of people ask me how I'm able to run my business while traveling the world and having lots of amazing adventures. And it comes down to finding a system that works for me and keeps me motivated and on task. What works is going to be different for each person. Just as well, I wake up at 5.30 a.m. every day and get the vast majority of my work done before lunch and then have my afternoons free. While others may be totally night owls and do their best work after 10 p.m., there may be a tool that is a godsend for me that someone else finds totally useless. If you're looking to improve your productivity, you're more than likely going to have to experiment with a few different things to find what works for you. But here are the productivity tools and tricks that I use that have literally changed my life. First of all, I organize my life through Gmail. I have six separate email accounts that are all active, but I have them all come to one Gmail inbox so that I can keep track of everything in one place. And I use a Gmail lab called Multiple Inboxes that helps me sort my emails in a way that works great for me. To get it, go to Settings in your Gmail account, click Labs at the top of the screen, find the lab called Multiple Inboxes by Vivi and enable it. Then go to the Multiple Inboxes tab along the top and you can set up how you want your multiple inboxes to sort and to look. Personally, I have three special inboxes that I stack above the regular inbox. At the top, I have it show me all unread emails. Then the second inbox is all of my drafts, the emails that I'm in the process of writing but I haven't finished and sent yet. And the third inbox is all starred emails. And then the regular inbox shows below that. I have a whole system of marking emails unread and starring them to help me know what needs to be done for each email and when. Now, it may not work for you, but just having all of the unread messages show at the top was a game changer for me. Now, sticking with email, I also use an add-on called Boomerang that lets you set reminders for follow-up to emails and schedule emails to be sent later on. This is ideal for me because I travel so much. With Boomerang, I can write a bunch of emails the night before a long flight, for example, but then schedule them to go out at preset times throughout the travel day. It also allows me to set an alert on emails that I'm sending out to remind me to follow up if nobody responds within a preset time frame. And it allows me remove emails from my inbox temporarily, but then show back up as unread emails after a certain period of time. This, combined with my multiple inboxes system that I subscribed above, is how I run my entire life, both business and personal. Finally, on the email front, I have joined the don't check email all day long cult, and I am happily drinking that Kool-Aid. I don't check my email at all before noon, and then I only check it at a few intervals throughout the afternoon and evening. I do not have it constantly open, and this one little life hack has done absolute wonders for my productivity. The final tool that I use that has been life-changing for me is a Pomodoro timer. Pomodoro is a productivity technique that combines short bursts of focused productivity with frequent scheduled breaks. Knowing that you only have so much time to work and then you'll have to take a required break makes you focus and increases your productivity greatly, as do all of the little mini breaks throughout the day. My timer is 25 minutes of focused work followed by five minutes of break time. And I use a desktop app called Pomodiro to keep the time and track my to-do list. Now, this break time can be used for anything you choose, going for a walk, surfing Facebook, whatever, it doesn't matter. I use the five minute break to do little micro workouts, stuff like squats, lunges, jumping jacks, push-ups, yoga stretches, stuff like that. This keeps my metabolism elevated and gives me energy throughout the day without me taking time out for a real workout where I'd have to sweat and then go take a shower before getting back to work. And if you know me, you know that I absolutely despise the gym, but this trick has kept me at just over 100 pounds despite eating like a linebacker, and it's roughly quadrupled my productivity on the days when I stick to it. Again, every person needs to find their own productivity hacks and tools, but I hope that this list of what works for me is helpful to at least some of you. If it was, please like it and share it with any of your friends or colleagues who could also use some help getting their ish done more productively. Please leave a comment and let me know which of these tricks you're going to try. 
And then once you do, let me know in the comments how they worked out for you. Also, if you have other productivity hacks or tools that you use, I would love to hear about them. So leave me a note with those as well. If you have a question about planning, launching, or growing your new business, make sure to head over to katecosta.com and visit the Q&A with Kate tab to submit your question. And while you're there, check out the New Venture Mentor blog and sign up for my newsletter to ensure that you don't miss out on any information that could help you reach your business goals. Did you find this video helpful or fun? Then share it with a friend who you think would benefit from the dish. And don't forget to follow me on Twitter and Facebook and subscribe to my channel on YouTube so you never miss any of the latest tips, tricks, and tutorials to help your business grow. And you get to see my adventures through the wide world of entrepreneurship and how I use the freedom running my own business gives me. Also, remember to head over to katecosta.com so you can get in on the conversation about how to build your business to success so you can live your life your way.